Okay, guys, this is try number seven, five, six, something around there. Um, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. So this is try number six. We've got three minutes there, and we've got a minute and a half there. I went ahead and talked to the S Plus dev, uh, and they said pretty much that it, it just, it's extremely buggy right now. Uh, I asked if that was something within the scope of what the mod can fix, or if it's just going to have to be an arc thing, and I didn't get an answer back yet. Uh, but, you know, best thing you can do is just keep trying the platforms, and just keep breeding, 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 until you maybe get one. Uh, also, I guess once, sometimes they're born invisible, so if you TP away, that helps. But uh, I tried that all the times and it hasn't worked. Uh, apparently they can glitch completely under the world. Like they start at the bottom and have to like maybe make their way up here through burrowing and it just doesn't happen. So we'll, we'll see what's going on here. Um, I still think the gestation times are messed up pretty bad because it just, I don't know. They also say ready to mate when they're not ready to mate, uh, which is interesting. So that's kind of another little glitchy thing going on. Um, we just lose our sight on that. Oh, there we go. We're just stuck at the five seconds. Okay, ready to mate. And there's only two snakes here. And there's nothing else. Okay. And then over here we've got a minute and a half. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and try TPing. Um, go ahead and, oops. Let's TP to, I don't know, somewhere random. And now teleport back. see is there a third snake there's not a third snake all right so oh i saw this just now i was like oh there's something snaky looking up here and then no all right well that's the next fail there we got 42 seconds on this one let's see what we get Come on, Mrs. Danger Noodle. You can do it. Give us a baby Danger Noodle. You can do it. Man, this is like rolling dice, guys. Like a 14-sided <laughs> dice. Ready to mate. Nothing happened. No new snakes. Ah. Alright, well, we're gonna steal another one of Rebug Snakes and breed her. And uh, see how that goes, and then we wait for the countdown timer and start all over again. Yay! Alright, we got 19 seconds, guys. This is try number seven. Come on. Just, just give me a snake. That's all I want. And nothing. I'm I'm really starting to think this doesn't even work. Like at all. <sighs> Alright, well. We'll keep trying once the timer's reset, guys. Okay, guys, uh, I TP back, and I, I think we found the goal to how this will work, guys. Uh, uh, teleporting them makes them work. We got one baby, and two babies. Oh. 
and they are on on enable one. Oh, they are wandering. Uh, why are they all wandering? Oh, geez. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, oh, they're just everywhere. There's basilisks everywhere. Um, uh, uh, options. Oh, no. Behavior, behavior. Disable wandering. Uh, there needs to be a be disable wandering whistle. Uh. Disable wandering. Oh. Okay. Behavior. Disable wandering. Okay. Well, they all ended up being orange. Uh, what did we get? We got a, another female. Nice. And another female. Two females. Alrighty. I don't... I. Who ended up being the parents here? This is... Bellatrix. What? Uh... Bellatrix and TG G and then Bellatrix Oh, Ancestry Line, Medusa Wait, what? Bellatrix and Basilisk number What is going on here? Where? That doesn't even make sense. I am very confused of how any of this just happened. But uh, yeah, we got some basilisk guys. Um, they don't look like they have any mutations i didn't even pay attention just now did they i mean we used the mutator random one random mutation i guess it's uh i don't i don't really see what it is i mean hmm and then zero mutations uh so its parents was Bellatrix and basilis 857 857 that is so weird what if what if what if we go back and do another teleport we're gonna end up with even more basilis uh oh my goodness uh, Basilisk 822. Basilisk 822. Oh my goodness. We have so many Basilisks. They're just... They were just invisible. Uh, wow. Okay. So who are the parents of these? Medusa and TGG. No mutations. Okay. And this one is... Medusa and TGG, zero mutations. Okay. So... Oh, and we got a what? A female... And a male. Right, this is crazy. So, I guess... Teleporting... Made them all pop out. Alright, well, uh, guys, we got some freaking snakes, man. That's awesome. Alright, well, we're gonna, I think, breed them again and see what kind of mutations we can get. I'm pretty excited. I hope you guys are, too. Alright, so we're breeding the babies. <clears throat> and, uh, less than 50 seconds left. So let's see if this teleporter thing is the trick to fixing it. Just for tracking purposes, I've named them like female one, two, three, male one, you know, that kind of thing.
Oh, no. I just realized the mutation pulses weren't going. There we go. Ooh, that was close. <coughs> Three seconds, two, one, zero. Yep. Uh, it's a little more than three seconds. That's cool. Arc just can't math. Or tell time, I guess. Huh. Arc can't tell time. That's so fitting. That is a long three seconds. Some server lag or something here. Uh, oh, there we go. All right. That one did her thing. And we got 15 seconds left here. Come on. Okay, we're done. We're gonna unhitch. Unhitch. Apparently he wasn't even hitched. All right. Now we teleport everyone back to my base. Hopefully with some snack babies. Did this work? There we go. Here's Basilisk Claim. And another one. Claim. Claim. All right, we got two new Basilisks. Wow, we have way too many Basilisks now. But that's that's really awesome. Um, behavior. Disable wandering. Uh, behavior. Oh, okay, that's the same state. Um, oh, where is it? It's noodling over here. Is this one white? That's kind of cool looking. Uh, behavior. What? Uh, behavior. Um, oh, it's stuck over here. Behavior, disable wandering. All right, guys. Well, we have a ton of basilisks now. That's crazy. Um, let's. Oh, they take up so much space. It's gonna be a pain to breed them. Uh, let's see. Show ancestors. Oh, I keep selecting Mr. Danger Noodle. How about this one here? Uh, zero mutations. Medusa. And Basilisk 880. What? Are these more than what we have? I, that is confusing. Right, that one's getting all crazy over there. And then we got another one over here somewhere, right? Is this 860? That's it. Show ancestors. One mutation, and it's the female number one and Basilisk 857. They're breeding with Basilisks that don't exist. I, I feel like every Basilisk that we bred is somehow under here somewhere still. Uh, I guess we'll go... We'll teleport from here to... Let's go to my... Uh... Where's... My... Trilobite River. Blue 
through surface. Yeah, definitely not surface. Um, my base should be the transformation platform. There we go. Let's see if this takes even more snakes. Any more? No? Huh. Well, alright guys, uh, I, we got some more basilisks, so I think we're going to keep breeding until we get some more mutations. And uh, that's going to do it for, I think, the breeding portion of this video for now. Okay guys, so we're back, and um, this is a different day. I didn't have time to finish up the video yesterday. Anywho, uh, we've got a couple of mutations. Um, this one has one, and you can see it's like an extra red color. Which is really cool. And then... This one, I think, has a mutation. No, this one has no mutations on the male. And then... Let's see. One mutation over here. I'm confused. Male number two. That's male number two. Oh, and this is female number three, which has no mutations. Okay, weird. Anyways, we're gonna go ahead and breed them again. And there they go. Now there's no progress bar, they just make their noise and all of a sudden they're just stating. Just like we showed earlier. Uh, another thing I'd like to mention is that Dino Storage mod that I showed you guys last time uh, just completely got removed. I don't know why. It disappeared. I'm pretty angry. I lost like 20 Ravagers. I think DMAC lost some stuff as well. Um, so yeah, not, not super happy on that. That's a huge disappointment. Uh, right now I'm trying to find that mod dev, but I can't because I don't remember what his name was. So... Yeah, that's a little irritating. Here they go. Alright, well, we're going to see if we can get some more uh, mutations coming up. We'll go ahead and create the mutation pulses. Boom. Boom. Awesome. That should last through. And uh, we'll be back. It takes about 12 minutes or so for them to gestate. So uh, we'll be back after that and see what we can. Alright guys, we're about to have our snake babies. These uh, countdown need to kind of fix themselves there. Come on. You can do it. Boom. Done. Alright. There's one baby. I guess. You know. Maybe. And then... Come on. And done. And did that actually poop out one I can see? That pooped out one we can see. Boom. 840 Basilisk right here. And it, ooh, it's got like a red belly, it looks like. Uh, 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 behavior, disable wandering. Okay. Look at that, dude. It's got like a pinky red bottom. That's really cool. 
Uh, let's see. Show ancestors three mutations. That's awesome. Wonder what the other mutations are. Everything else looks fairly normal. Huh. Alright, so one of the babies actually just popped out like it should. Now, the other one didn't, so we're going to have to do some TP Roonies. See if my theory sticks up. A little TP right back to German base. And we've got... Huh. Two snakes. That's it. Something's not right here. Oh. So I guess we'll TP back there and see what's going on. They can't just not have a baby. I don't think that's a thing. This is so confusing. One worked how it was supposed to, and the other one just doesn't exist. Alright. Alright. That one's still down there with its actually pretty sweet looking colors. So. I'm gonna say like it got wedged into the wall and we're gonna try TP from there this is basically what I've been doing this whole entire time just trying to like find them so we'll see if it got stuck over here somewhere yep it did boom claim basilisk behavior disable wandering ooh look at this one red with red that is really cool that's really cool. Let's see how many mutations. Two mutations. That's that's still really awesome. All right, we got our other baby. Let's uh, just toss a saddle on it and move it. Already have some saddles left over from some of the ones I bred and then decided to get rid of. Ah, oh, dude, this is such a cool snake. I like the red colors. That's that's really great. Wait. Oh, okay. That was this one just hanging out over there. Uh, let's go ahead and TP back to the platform one more time. Just make sure we didn't get twins or anything like that. It's it's a really tricky thing with this, so you want to make sure you kind of cover everything. Otherwise, you're going to end up with like a bunch of random basilisks uh, underneath the map, and that's just not good for lag reasons. Alright, wasn't twins. Alright, so we can pretty much safely say that was that. So, uh, I think that's going to do it for this video, guys. It's pretty much just a bunch of random basilisk breeding. Uh, but I think that's pretty exciting. Uh, I really wish these would be breedable in the default game, but that's not the case. So, toss me some awesome basilisk names out there, guys. Uh, we're going to be keeping some of them. I just had to go with Mr. Danger Noodle for our original male because, you know, Mr. and Mrs. Danger Noodle. It just, it makes sense. You have to. You know what I mean? But, uh, yeah, we're going to need some other names. And, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to see what you guys come up with. So, thanks for watching. And we will see you guys next time. Don't forget to click that bell notification in case you don't, so you don't miss any videos. And leave a like. Share with your entire family, their family, your dog's family, and everyone. Because that's what you have to do. Or else... I'll send the snake army on you.